This is not about yellow-brown babies for the revolution. This is about love. But this is about more than just love. This is about the yellow-brown baby and how she left her home and settled in a new country. This is about how she let go of her Chinese citizenship and was naturalized and raised in America, and yet, still somehow, remains connected to what once was and in many ways will always be home. And this is about love. This is about an American mother who flew to China to adopt a daughter. This is about the picture she took of her daughter, in the arms of her foster mother, in the arms of a Chinese physician, and in a makeshift bed of two chairs pushed together in a hotel in Wuhan, China. This is about the photo album she filled with all of these pictures and kept for her daughter. This is about the yellow-brown baby's favorite bedtime book. This is about her at the age of four, laying in the big bed with her mothers, paging through pictures, asking to hear more about where she came from, who her foster mother was. Did she love me? This is about a window into her past, a collection of people, places, and experiences that she was too young to remember, but that have been passed down through pictures and oral history. This is about how they became her memories. This is about never having the talk with her parents. This is not about reinforcing similarities. This is about recognizing differences as a strength and an identity, rather than a source of insecurity or disconnection. This is about pride and reclamation. This is about how a picture is worth a thousand words, which means a photo album is worth millions of words of bedtime stories, of discussions of return, of identity, of belonging, discussions that have happened, and discussions that will. This is not about white parents stripping their yellow-brown child of any remnants of their past culture. This is not about white parents saving the yellow-brown baby and taking them to a country free of child labor, of racism, of poverty, of illiteracy, of human rights violation, a country of highly educated, liberated patriots, a better country. This is not about white parents saving the yellow-brown baby. No, this is about white parents and a Chinese baby. This is about my history and my narrative.